Hi kids, I'm Storytime Pup, and welcome to the Storytime Pup Show. I'm so glad you came by to play. I love when my friends come by to play, and you're one of my friends. Are you ready to have fun? Let's see what we're going to do today. Magic Marker, show us what we're going to do today. Yay! It's storybook time! We love storybook time! Hi kids! Today I'm going to be reading a book about animal friends. This book is called A Catfish Tale. And it's written by my friend Kathy Brodsky and illustrated by Cameron Bennett. Are you ready? Okay, let's go read this fun book. I'm a regular cat with a tale to tell about three fish I know quite well. My friend Charlie had some fish in a tank. The fish were his friends, Gretchen, Susie, and Hank. Charlie's fish were a good part of his life. He hardly went out, had no children or wife. One day, Charlie had a great inspiration. He'd get a college degree. There was no hesitation. He researched some schools and came up with a few. A school in Wisconsin. Yes, Wisconsin would do. Wisconsin was far from our Cape Cod town. But Charlie was eager to get started. Settle down. But one of his pals, Gretchen, Susie, and Hank, he would leave them behind in their heated fish tank. Charlie left me in charge. I left much as before. But temptation was lurking behind that closed door. While feeding and taking good care of his fish, I picture them all lined up in a dish. Yikes! One day I came home and found a surprise. Tiny fish were swimming with the older big guys. What should I do? I bought a fish pen. That would keep them inside to protect them. And then... Many more babies arrived as years passed. New tanks were needed. They outgrew them quite fast. At last I decided enough was enough of cleaning and feeding and all of that stuff. Besides, I'm a cat and it's plain to see. Cats love to eat fish and I'm getting hungry. I called my friend Charlie in that town far away. I told him I'd be there within a few days. How would I take them? I couldn't drive. My legs are too short, but the fish had to arrive. I bundled each fish with its own family in containers and bags to accompany me. I hired a driver, drove part way one day, spent the night at the inn, sneaked in the back way. Was afraid to get caught. Pets weren't allowed, but I had to deliver the fish and right now. The next day we got there, the fish did survive. And Charlie was glad that his friends were alive. Now that the fish are back with their dad, I'm alone in my house, kind of happy, yet sad. They were my friends too. Fish are good company. But maybe it's time for a puppy. 
or two just for me. The end. What did you think of that book? I thought it was a nice book about friendship, but boy, a cat having to take care of fish? That sure was tempting. It just shows you what friendship can do. I hope you enjoyed this fun animal book. And by the way, this book is also available in Spanish. You can look in the description below if you want to see the version in Spanish. A big thank you to Kathy Brodsky for that great book. You can read more about Kathy Brodsky and her books by looking in the description below. Wasn't that great? I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, click on the thumbs up button below. Moms, dads, and adults, please leave your and your children's comments below. This way we know what shows you like so we can make more of them. There's one more thing that we always do at the end of every show. Magic glasses. Magic glasses lets me see some of my friends who came to play. Maybe I'll see you today. Magic glasses, that's the way. Show me my friends who came to play. Okay, now everyone smile and wave and let me see if I see you. Oh, I see Layla and Eric. <laughs> There's Ava and Maddox and Stella. Oh, hi, Timothy and Marissa. There's Pedro and Charlie. Oh, hi, Bradley and Audrey and Levi. Oh, hi, Amelia. Oh, I see a lot of my friends waving at me. Did I see you today? If not, maybe I'll see you next time. Make sure you check back soon, because we'll be adding a bunch of new shows every week. Make sure you have an adult. Click on the subscribe button right here. That way you won't miss any of the fun. Moms and dads, make sure you visit the Storytime Pup website to sign up for our great free giveaways. We have giveaways for books, CDs, DVDs, T-shirts, and other great stuff. Sign up just once, and you'll have a chance for all the drawings to come. And kids, don't forget to tell your friends about Storytime Pup. And before I go, here's a great big hug for all my friends. Thanks for stopping by to play. I'll see you real soon. Bye now. The fun's not over yet, kids. Click below for more fun videos. There's children's books, let's pretend, and games. And don't forget to subscribe by clicking right here.